Welcome back, and of course, you're still watching Wake Up Nigeria, and we're here in the kitchen, and standing right here with me. Chef Maudi. Chef Maudi. Yes, you can see it on your branded chef. I can see it on his head. <laughs> How are you doing this morning? I'm great. Okay, great. So I see some kind of very interesting um, things lined up here today. I can already sense like some very, very specific herbs. I call them herbs or leaves. So now, what are we preparing today? This morning, we'll be making an afang soup. Afang soup. It's like you read my mind. I've been thinking of some other soup to make, aside Obono, Igusi, and all the others. So now, this is something I'm definitely going to try out. So now, tell me, what exactly do we need to bring this afang soup to life? Yeah, here, mm. I have my already parboiled um, goat meat. OK. Yeah, mm -hmm. it has um, stock fish inside with dry fish. OK. Yeah, this is my palm oil. Mm -hmm. So this is my bomo. Mm. I will still chop it into biteable sizes. Okay. Then this periwinkle. Mm. This is already cut and washed um, water leaf. Okay, this, water leaf. Yeah, this okay. Is blended okazi. Okay. Leaf. What did you blend that with? Some blended, yes, not sliced. Yes, did yeah. you blend it with something? Because I see some. Yes, I, I had to use the um, crayfish to bring it out from the engine. Oh, yes. Okazi. Yes, okay. Yeah. Then this um, blended crayfish. Okay. This is my yellow hey, chili yellow pepper. pepper this nice. salt. Salt. Okay. So now quickly run me through um, the preparatory method for this particular dish. Okay. Before now, I've already uh, cooked my meat, okay. the protein for the soup mm -hmm. with the stock fish. This is the main thing you you do. You need. Oh, yeah, okay. you need. Yes. Okay. After this. You so can you cook add, that with um, seasoning? Yes, I added and seasoning. Any other yeah. special spice? It's just seasoning cube and salt. And salt, that's yes, all, okay. Yes. Okay. So mm -hmm. once this is cooked, then you add your palm oil. Into, into the, the pot. pot. Okay. Yes. With it on the mix. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Then after adding your palm oil, you can add your water leaf. Okay. Then followed by your crayfish. Mm -hmm. Then. Okazi leaf. Okazi yeah. leaf. So what is the star ingredient for this particular dish? Okazi. Is okazi leaf. Yes. Okay, now why did you choose this particular um, um, recipe today? Because um, I found that lately my customers, mm -hmm. they really, they've been, there's been back-to-back -back order. Mm -hmm. this oh, very, for this particular dish. Yes. Why do you so think I just decided to... Do you think the weather has anything to do with this? Mm. It is raining. Yes, I think, yes, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> and definitely because of the rainy season, we actually get a lot of water. Yeah, yeah water leaves. And all of that yes, is usually yeah. fresh. That's actually very good. So now, what are we having this with today? Because, of course, I mean, I know some people try to like to take their soup like that. Yes. But I, I, I know this you one you'll be having it with semo. Okay, so now what's the... Well, how do we prepare our semo? Just for people that don't know. Put your water on fire. Yes. Once it's boiled, you have to put excess water. Okay. Then once it's boiled, you, you remove the one that you used to cook the semo after stirring it. Mm -hmm. Keep it aside. So when you mix stir, mm -hmm. as you are pouring, you are stirring con continuously, continuously. So it doesn't have, have lumps. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So when you are done, you cannot add the water you removed, then cover it to cook well. To cook properly. Yes, so you're not, are time. you one of those people that mix, because girl, I don't know, I, I've seen people mix the semo first in, first. in normal water. I only do like that. I, do, I, I only mix when I'm doing for a larger quantity. Oh, I mean, okay. I'm, I'm making like 20 kg of semo. Mm -hmm. I, I'll mix it down. So why, why, why do you do because that? Because it's difficult to stir. Okay, all together. Yeah, all together. Once. Okay, so it's better to... More, yes. Okay, nice. Okay, now, new skill. Okay, so now, in case you're just joining us, we're making afang soup, right? And, of course, for afang soup, we have the ingredients right there on the screen. And, of course, we have some salt. We have some okazi, which is a star um, ingredient of this particular dish. We have some pepper, some dried fish, some crayfish, some cow skin, palm oil, stock fish, goat meat, water leaf, periwinkle, seasoning cubes, and... Uh, Water. I'm sure you use water at some point, right? <laughs> and we'll be making that with um, Semo today. So while we literally allow Chef, Chef Maldi go over this, right, we'll actually head over to the couch where we have Titi standing by for a very interesting conversation. Okay, um, so we're back to the Wake Up Nigeria kitchen. And of course, we have Chef Maldi here, had at work. So now, I'm getting a bit worried because everything is um, still complete here. <laughs> but I believe you have uh, some, you have speed, Abby? Yeah. Oh, yeah, now, so what are we doing next? Because I noticed you put the yes. meat. I've already chopped the bomo uh, yeah. to biteable size. It's already here, boiling. Yeah. So I think that's boiled enough. Mm -hmm. I cannot so add now, my palm oil. Palm oil right on it. Yes. Okay. 
Mm, okay. Mm. So now, why do we put the palm oil at this at this stage and not later? So to allow it cook. Properly. No, if, it, if, if it doesn't cook properly, mm -hmm. it's had this that uh, raw taste. Raw that we taste, yeah. so is, is, there, is there another method to cooking palm oil with for this particular soup? Can we fry? So, it? Yeah, you can fry. So. Oh, okay. At times, if I want to freestyle, I can actually fr fry it. Yes, okay. Before, before. okay, because I was wondering because I know my mom growing up, like we barely ever put like raw palm oil, yeah. palm oil in. She always made sure she fried it before she put it in. Okay, so what do we do next? Now we it's stir fair. it to make sure it goes round. Well, it's literally already looking so yummy. I literally can't wait for see what it's going to turn turn out to be. In case you're just joining us, we're making afang soup this morning with Chef Maldi, right? And uh, afang definitely is going with some semo. And our uh, water is already boiling on the fire. Okay, so the now pepper. we... Okay, the pepper. Can we use red pepper in this case? Good choice. I prefer this one, so it has this unique flavor. flavor. Oh, yes, very true. So we can use... Can we use tomato too? No, the food, I can't, can't, the food can't actually cook without tomato. tomato. You know what I mean? I don't, I don't you know. <laughs> the food will take it a step further and use a, a, a tin tomato. <laughs> but uh, let's desist from it, right? Yeah. So we have our fresh yellow pepper blended and toasting. Looking good. And our crayfish. I'm going to see how much of this crayfish you're going to put. Okay. I was scared you were going to put everything. Yeah, almost there. Nice. Mmm. Hmm? Okay. <laughs> okay. How'd that work? Nice. So now what was it that actually, where did you start cooking from? What is it about cooking that intrigues you so much? When growing up, mm -hmm. I've always had this flair for cooking. Why? Where did yes. it come from? Yeah. Because I've come from somewhere. Where did it come from? I stayed with my grandmother. Uh, hey, that's it. That's I all you needed to say. <laughs> okay. So I practically... You're out, always helping her out, out her in the kitchen, kitchen and, and all of that. Nice. That was, that was when I picked interest in, in cooking. And since then, you see, it's not so bad, right? Well, cover it. Okay, cover it for a bit, let it cook. And of course, when we are back, we we'll definitely just have the vegetables toasting. And of course, the vegetables don't take long to cook, so it's not going to take time at all. So I'm sure very soon you actually have to mix um, the semo and all of that. Guys, I mean, we bring it all to you right here on Wake Up Nigeria, so make sure you never miss an episode of the show. Right around now, it's the top of the hour, so we have to go on a quick break, and we'll definitely be back. Stay tuned. Yeah. Okay, so now um, we're here with Chef Maudi. He's been hard at work. Yes, sir. Putting this together. What we have here is afang soup and some semovita. Okay. Right, so now what we want you to do is taste it and tell us exactly Watch it. Ah, why are you closing my eye? I should <laughs> say taste. I should taste. I finish it. Or I, 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 it. I should act uh, posh. You know you uh, finish it. My brother, if you want to wash hand, we'll give you water now. Okay. <laughs> Tell us what you think. Please. Can you you got to okay, find yeah. Out. So yeah. I was watching the health tips. They always, always have water. Oh. Just drink okay, water. first. Drink water okay. first. Nice. Mm -hmm. nice mm -hmm. I'm a big fan. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. So I'm very shy, yo. Yeah, okay. shy. Be shy. shy to eat. Don't be shy. All right, normally you don't use fork, but we're on TV now. So. <laughs> All right. Hmm. Hmm. Time to speak in tongues. <laughs> <laughs> this kind of point, I'll close my eyes. Right? Uh -huh. Visualize. Wow, well, this is actually amazing. Oh, nice. This is amazing. Right. Well done, Maldi. Well done. Thank well done. This is amazing. This is well amazing. Well done. Yes, yeah. sir. Yeah, okay. we appreciate you, Chef Maudi. We appreciate everyone who's been part of the show today. And we're going to be back again tomorrow, right? Definitely, definitely. Thanks to everyone that's joined us from the beginning of the week. I mean, we're getting deeper. So, mm -hmm. yeah, make sure you keep it locked right here. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. All right, then, everyone. Bye. Bye.